Welcome back to Let's Play Sphinx and the Cursed Mummy. I'm Burning Dog Face, and last time we translated the last of the uh, golden pillars, golden obelisks, sorry, of Heliopolis, and discovered that they describe an ancient prophecy about me. Most unusual. You have done it! You have translated the five golden obelisks of Heliopolis! He just knows, and doesn't even have to say anything. This message is incredible! The ancients foresaw that darkness would descend upon us and inscribed the ancient prophecy of Ra on the obelisks. When the age of Osiris comes to an end, the shadow of Set will descend upon us. But a great warrior by the name of Sphinx, unnecessary comma, will emerge as the chosen one, unnecessary comma, to defend the eternal eye of Ra. It is you! You are the Chosen One! I don't know what to say. I want you to take this to help you on your quest. It is a magical statue which is said to unlock the Great Obelisk in the cliffs above South Beach. I swear that's the, uh... Well, it's not exactly the same, but I swear that's based on the, uh, the Golden Idol from the very beginning of uh, Raiders of the Lost Ark. You must succeed in your quest. The fate of all lies in your hands. Good luck, great warrior. Thank you. You got the Hathor statue! This golden effigy is said to have magical powers. I thought Hathor had the head of a cat. No, no, that was Bast. I don't know anything about Hathor, then. I never actually looked at that. Rosetta Stone. The, the ancient Rosetta Stone allowing translation of ancient texts. Uh, so we're just checking these things. Uh, Hathor statue. A golden statue of the goddess Hathor imbued with magical powers. <laughs> they just... Uh... You need to go to the South Beach, I guess, but... What are you doing? Uh... That's right, there is no map in this game. Fair enough. You know, only just now it occurred to me how odd that is. Given that, you know... Not to just endlessly compare this game to Zelda, but we are talking about a uh, genre that had been well established since like 1986 as having uh, map screens. Uh, no, this is not where I need to be, but I know how to get there from here. I think. That was just past here, wasn't it? I wasn't sure if I had another one or not. Uh, no. This just goes here. Piss. Well, alright, I'll just talk to the guy then. No big deal. Another one. veer off to the side here and get a save in on our way. You there, Harvey Birdman. Uh, South Beach. So that... Hmm. 
So is that the one I was thinking of, or did I was I just mistaken? Did I just find another unrelated one? I didn't see anywhere to put that. Is there anything under the water? I could talk to uh, Imhotep while I'm in the region. Huh. He didn't disappear with a flash of light. Maybe fish don't have souls. Or, you know, maybe that's that fish. I don't want to throw all fish under the bus. Okay. Scratchy, scratch, scratch. Um. Shit. I mean, I could check the footage again, but I am basically certain that guy said South Beach. going into your house to find pots to break. Where does this go? Oh, yes. Heliopolis Point. That's one of the places I can go in the thing, but I suddenly realize I have no memory of it. All right, let's find out, I guess. I just wonder if I should go back to the Bedouin outpost and see if I can... I mean, go confirm where the obelisk I found was. Probably seven million dollar it is. Hmm. Stretch! Ah! Love a good stretch. Shit, this is where the guy running guy must be. I'm gonna use the eye over there instead of over here. Oh yeah. Hmm. What an unpleasant place. Okay, I don't know how much I have. I'm not gonna lie, I was kind of expecting Onyx Scarab to come out of that one. Like, if you can really only get to them from, uh, the palace... What are you? Great. Okay, so obviously the cave door glyph had opened this. Yeah, yeah, that would do it. I have a glyph key. God damn you. I don't remember seeing one of those anywhere. How many of those things do I have? Uh, 205. Uh, 
10, 150, 50. get this for the convenience of it? Do I get this? Hmm. I can get regular money anywhere. And I can just, you know, use the boats to get from South Beach to the Opolis Point. So I'm gonna get these. You got four tune eyes. Look, they fit into the eye sockets of a statue of some kind. Huh? Not very talkative, is he? What a strange man. find a lot of dollar dues before I can do the ritual to get another uh, health unk, but I would like to do that before I do anything Im really important. one was uh, up here, I think. Oh, what's that about camera? Okay, yes. There is the uh, the temple where uh, Imhotep lives, so this is definitely the same place. So where the fuck is the... I'm gonna keep searching up here. Maybe over there. There's a fancy looking gate over there. Check it out. Prestidigitation! Float it over there. Hey guys. I thought you were monsters. I don't think it's even any bigger than the other ones. Oh no, maybe. Now that I realize how small the uh, people are. Hey, guy. Uh, the great obelisk will only reveal its secret to the one of the prophecy. Only the one of the prophecy will be able to unlock the secret of the Great Obelisk. The one of the prophecy will conquer the lost temple of Heliopolis, translate the text to the ancients, and discover the secret of the Great Obelisk. Inside the Great Obelisk is an item of great importance to the one of the prophecy. You're the first guy, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
strange that it didn't have any text on it. I just didn't see any. I hope there wasn't any, because now I can't read it. But how? Oh, this thing had been here for a million years. What's this doing inside of it? You got a canopic jar, part of the soul of Tutankhamun, a, sto a sword stored inside. Okay, so let's go get that sacred crown of Uruk, I guess. Although this is the last one. The last of the four canopic vases. If he drops dead after this, he's not coming back again until we break the curse. Hmm, nothing here. Oh, aside from several hundred dead bodies. I went to all cor corners of the castle, inspected carefully. Set is infuriated because we've yet to find the intruder. We'll hunt around the clock if necessary. We are wasting time here. Come, we'll go to the north wing. How did you miss that? Long time no see, my friend. Yet another canopic vase safely delivered. I'm sure we'll have you back to your old self in no time. Till then, we still need you to gather as many artifacts and bits of information as you can. You are doing great so far. Keep up the good work. See you soon! Exactly like a button. Can't open that. Uh, oh, right. Forgot to get a uh, crouch. Well, here comes the. Oh. I was totally about to face palm uh, face palm face plant out there. It's repeating itself because you're going to have to do a bunch of videos today. So I don't see a save point in this area. Four things open four things on four sides, so I need to get four blocks or something. Maybe four cages with skeletons in them. Huh. Surprised that in this castle that isn't a dead drop. Oh, right, you can't double jump as this guy. My bad. I am king to all of the sarcophagi, people. You may call me Ramesses. If you can light all of these torches around me, I'll give you an ancient artifact. 
careful, though. It's just as easy to extinguish them as it is to light them. I guess we'll figure out what that means in the next episode of Let's Play Sphinx and the Cursed Mummy. When I uh, try and figure out what's going on in this place... Uh... Oh, that's not what I wanted at all! Where am I trying to go? Oh, that's what that's for. Okay. Okay. And down the other side of the corridor is where I met Ramesses. Uh, these are the ones that are... No, this isn't. This isn't what's blocked off. Huh. This is going to be involved. <clears throat> anyway, I'll see you next time, Burning Dog fans. Later.